Draw a line on the right side presentation lens. The height of the line is optional. Try to make line in the middle of the lens. Create a job. We can enter any number as the code for this new job. Click Confirm button. Click Scan button. Place the marked right lens concave face up in the scanning area. Press Confirm button to finish scanning the lens. Input the bridge value and click Confirm button. Select the frame material. If left-right recognition not correct, it can be switched by pressing the LR switching button. Press the button below to check framing bending. Put on the frame and align with the marking. Press the arrows to adjust the curvature until the red line coincides with the frame. Press Confirm button. Lens axis and size can be modified in the Modification screen. Modify lens axis. If no adjustment is required, press the Return button. The size of the lens can also be adjusted. For example, we can keep the height of the lens unchanged and only change the width. Click the Confirmation button to preview the modified shape. Press the Cancel button if no adjustment is required. Function of each button. Fixed height, change width only. Fixed width, change height only. Modify the width while changing the height proportionally. Modify the height while changing the width proportionally. Change the distance of the lower edge. Proportional scaling. We can input right eye and left eye PD and pH separately. Input right eye PD. The data of the right eye is loaded by default in the left eye. Input right eye pH. If the data of left eye is different with right eye, we can enter it separately. Select the size of the blocking disk. Select blocking mode. The pH displaying mode switch. The appropriate display mode can be selected according to the requirement of edging precision. Choose right side lens firstly. The buttons on the left can adjust the brightness. Marking types for leave blocking. Place the lens marked with lens meter on the scanning area. Move the lens so that the optical center on the lens coincides with the cross and all three points are on the dotted line. Install the blocking disc with double side adhesive sticker onto the lens. Return to the main interface.
choose lens material. Choose lens type, edging process type and other items. Put the blocked lens on the clamping shaft and press the clamp button. Close visor and press start. The machine will finish edging process automatically. System will automatically detect lens thickness at different position and decide the bevel or groove location. The lights in the chamber will blink when the edging is finished. Open the visor, hold the lens and open the shaft to take out the lens. If the size of the edge lens is too large, do not take off the block and put the lens back for retouch. Press the retouch button on the screen. Input the value and start retouch process. The machine will automatically complete the retouch process. When the retouch is finished, remove the lens. Switch R to L to continue the processing of the left lens. The method is the same as the right lens. 